Today is April 21 to 12 p.m. We saw unusual options on Sonos. That's S-O-N-O, ticker symbol. And uh, keep in mind, earnings is uh, coming up and about May 10. And uh, as usual, let's get right to those unusual options. So... Um, you'll see here these May 5s. So this is actually before earnings. So that's what's interesting is that these 22 strike calls, you'll see a lot of these. There was some 21 strike calls as well. Um, and you'll see down here lots of these 22 strike calls for the May 5s. Okay. And uh, so when we go to the options chain and take a look at May 5. You'll see this um, is heavily concentrated here at the 22 strike calls. Okay, so they're going for um, somewhere between 15 to $20 uh, right now. We are also in this position. Um, there's close to 6,900 the volume here much greater than the 63 open interest so we know these are open orders um, and uh, if we also look at this today's option statistic you'll see that the uh, volatility is 23 percent historically also it's seven not very high the other thing to see is also on the options chain if you look at the chain itself you'll see that this is quite a low uh, volatility at 35, the average 35%, quite low compared to the next um, uh, weeks of 60% because this is the earnings, um, the one right after earnings. And so it is uh, quite unusual that, and also quite uh, logical to be buying at a low volatility um, environment. So they're buying these because these are much lower. You see this 38% volatility, much lower in the volatility when you compare that with uh, the May 12s, right? You can look at the May 12s, the 22 strikes here. That's 50.9%, much higher, right? So you don't want to be buying options uh, when volatility is, is high. You want to buy them when they're low volatility. So you don't have to pay that extra premium. Okay, so um, you'll see the prices are 15 to 20. They were actually uh, already profitable because some of, some of the contracts were $10, right? They got them for $10. So that's already a, a profit of at least five. Um, or, um, yeah, so they already, uh, some of them already profitable. So um, that, uh, again, because this is low volatility and earnings is coming up, this volatility will increase. And since these options are um, positive Vega, when you buy one of these 22 um, uh, strike calls and you analyze this trade, you can see that the Vega is positive at one. So volatility, an increase in volatility is, is good for the trade, and that is... What will definitely happen as you approach earnings because this uh, there's a lot of anticipation heading into earnings and and so that is what this uh, this trade is trying to take advantage of the increase in volatility and uh, it does not necessarily have to break this 22 strikes here um, if we see an increase in volatility these options will increase in value and then they can sell it back uh, to the market for a profit okay so it does not have to go uh, above 22 and it could still be profitable so that's what's um uh what's different about um these these uh call options um before earnings so this is taking advantage of the high volatility increase that will be coming up as we approach this uh may uh, 10 okay um so that's still, we still have uh, 14 day, days. So there, there's this expectation of an increase in volatility. Okay, so um, if this was helpful and valuable, um, 
please smash that like button. Helps us uh, continue making these videos. And uh, comment below on what you think about this trade. And uh, if you are not subscribed, uh, please do so. And uh, s hit that bell icon and you'll be notified whenever we see these unusual options uh, come onto the tape. Uh, thank you and good luck to everybody.